He bit Dez once. He bit Dez once. You- oh! That was a max level! And welcome to Ark, where today, yeah, we're going after the Astro Delphus. So, as you guys may notice, Crush has his, uh, overshield, essentially. The force field is now back. I, I was able to get one over on Extinction, along with me a tech bow, some canteens, and I did bring over some food. Um, but I also brought over a feeding trough, so we should be all set up and ready to go with taming stuff and breeding it, the exclusives to Genesis Part 2. Now, there was a debate on whether or not to do Maywings or the Astro Delphus, but I just felt like after yesterday, I'm bet, am I going the wrong way? No, if I'm correct, this should be the right way. Because that over there should be the trench that's filled with water. Um, now, I don't know why I'm doing this, walking crush over. That is honestly probably the slowest way I could get there. Because I do got other guys here, and I need to remember to throw back cryopods. I need to keep three of them to come with me. But I do have Dez. Or not... Yeah, that's, me that's a Mega Shallon. Uh, I can't use Omega Shalon. I need Dez. Thank you. Thank you, Dez. Now, he should actually kind of help us here with Astro Delphus. Um, Dez, I really hope that you can breathe in space. Because, if not, do I got my remote with me? Yes, I did bring me a remote. Alright, uh, I forgot to get a spyglass. Oh, yeah. No, like, this here, like... Crush is somewhere back there. I've been flying for a good, like, three minutes, though. I mean, this is a big, big, big map. And I haven't even pulled up the Astro Delphus I want to go look for yet. Now, I know, like, look. Ooh, what happened? Oh, it's set to life. That's why. Look at all the 150s on this map. All right. Like, I'm used to seeing, like, maybe three, four. Like, I'd never have more than, like, this much. This is quite a bit. But in terms of life, we're going for this boy. Now, he is way far down there. Um, I'm going to see if I can try and find the... Would he be close to that? Let's look. He might be close enough to... I think he'd be close enough to that. It'd be worth it. Because we'd get to explore more in here. And out there, I'm pretty sure all it is is asteroids. I'm guessing you guys are not going to want to see uh, the same five different rocks. Or 70 different rocks. Uh, all with the same texture. You know? Just, yeah. So I figured maybe flying through here might be better. So if I see anything interesting, I'll let you guys know. Now, Dez is definitely one of my least used creatures. I know that the Sanguine Elixirs exist, but I've never really, like, early on, yes, I used them a lot more. That was when I was back still using Prime Meats and all that, and not depending on Kibbles. Before, like, I fully understood how to get a farm up and running, 100% efficient, like, all with just, like rapidly Ooh, look at you you're nice i'm um, also i've just been working on looking for a mod for the striders i think there's one where we can change out the parts on them hopefully if not uh we'll just do them normally is that a cave all right we'll go check this out if it seems like Hold up. Where are we? Could this be the, like, the tube? Is this the tube? Because, like, I realize this, se this section of the map got higher. Would this be higher up? I mean, this looks weird. Oh, okay. It's just another drop, and then... Boom. 
Oh yeah, no, this is the space tube. Or are you like an underground cave? Are you a cave? Are there caves on this map? Like... Am I like gonna like just explore like tech hallways and all that? I don't think so because this looks like the corridor to- yep, that's outer space. I kind of figured because we kept getting closer to that. But that's a nice way in. I honestly wouldn't have guessed that. If I hadn't gone and tried that the first thing, like we would have flown around for a couple hours. Oh, oh, look at that. We got a space whale. What level are you? You're level 20. I already know I can like go and breed up ones that are better than you. Also, Dez, is space hurting you? Oh, but there's no place for you to land. Okay. Dez, I can move in space fairly easy. I don't want you to... Wait. Oh, you regain stamina if I hop off you. Okay. We'll just do that then. Because he, he, I feel like he moves faster than me. And I'm guessing this pod of Alstradolphus here has my 150 in it. This is quite a few. Oh my god. Oh, laggy. Uh, space whales are probably what do that. I noticed that only when we went in the space zone. I think the space whales are just super laggy. And it might just be because of all the particle effects on them. Particle effects my PC hates. Now, if I recall, how do I do this without getting annihilated? Okay, let's just take the element. I think they said I have to have it in my hotbar. Now, we'll approach this Astrodelphus carefully. Uh, he's diving back into his pod. Hey, buddy, come here. Hey, hey, oh my god, they're all coming towards me. Nice, I petted you. Nice, nice. Um, hey, I don't, I don't think I have enough for all you guys. Ow. The whale's down there. So I think he should come back eventually. Or I can pet him again. But you... I'd say he's far enough away that. Are you dying? I don't need. I want your buddy to get aggro on me. Okay. Is the whale targeting me? That's a void worm down there. Oh. Oh, you see that? That's a void worm way down there. He doesn't come up here. That's essentially Tech Wyvern. Ah! Hey, can I pet you? Oh, requires one element. Oh! Oh! You are not what I wanted! Dez! Dez, I need your... I need to get to Dez. I need to get to Dez. You need to follow me. You need to follow me. You need to follow me. Ah, shoot. We gotta go tech rifle. I gotta kill this thing without hurting Dez. Oh, it's hurting me. 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 I can't move. I can't move. Nope. 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 This thing has some serious range on that fire. Alright, guys, we gotta go. We gotta go. We can't fight this thing. Oh my god! This thing is a full wyvern! Oh, you're probably a 152. Won't just be a max level void worm? And it's kicking my ass. It's gonna kill me. I don't have my pump and shotgun to just annihilate him either. The problem is, is he breathes his breath on me, he will hurt me. If I can keep chomping with Dez, he Dez will heal up eventually. I'm trying not to sprint. He bit Dez once. He bit Dez once. You- oh! That was a max level! That was a near max level! Alright. 
That was a 175 Void Worm? Please tell me that was the one that was way down there. And it, like, just finally snapped and came after us. Like, I'd hate to find out that that was just one that was closer. Oh, my God. That hurt. Oh. Hey, Delphus. There we go. Nice. So this is going to go like one piece, two piece, five piece, ten piece. So he's going to keep doubling it like your girlfriend asking for french fries. So I got Dez following me now. I'm going to eat some. Oh, I got to get on Dez to eat the meat. Okay. Going back to Astro. Do you want more? Hey, you lost taming efficiency. No, you didn't. You lost taming, though. Ow, dude, let me give you the element. Alright. So, you. I need to keep with him now. Now, I don't, I can't take another Void Worm. I don't care if it's 175 or not. I cannot. That hurt so much. Okay, he's, he's doing good. We should be able to keep this up. He should be staying at 90. But the void worms hurt. And I just saw another one over there towards the whale. So I know it can most definitely be headed this way easily. Let's get back to our our spunky boy over here, or Delphus. Just mash E when you're next to it, honestly. Just keep your thing on it, mash E. Don't get next to its head or it will like boy. Throw your ass. One of those oh! Swimming in the did I just tame it? I did! It oh! Dolphus. Space Dolphin! Space Dolphin! That's Space where the danger is! <laughs> tame and ride them. Okay. I have Space not looked at this guy's stats place. at all. All I know is that he's the highest health on the map. Sorry, I had to scream with my mouth closed because I don't want to damage this mouth, this mic anymore until the new one gets here. But that's 50 in the health. 50. Oh. All right, let's get out of here before pain comes this way. I need to find one with stamina. I really can care less for melee on them. I think that would be worth it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Dez, fly. Dez, fly. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Dive, dive, dive! <laughs> Alright, this is the only way we're going to outrun that Void Worm, is if we dive down. Inventory, inventory, inventory. Remote, remote, remote. Okay, 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 okay. Let's just do this. Let's get back to Turtle Base. And I got a plan. Okay. Now, let's pop out the Astro Delphus here. And let's get a better look at you without having to worry about... Ooh, we got a nice looking one. Alright, hold up. Let's turn that off. It's got blue and pink. Alright, we got a space dolphin with blue and pink. Oh, you look... Oh, I, I hit the water and boosted right past you. But yeah, no, this is exactly what I expected. You look amazing. This is what exactly what I expected when I hear space dolphin, honestly. Alright. Now, I have to go find two more and safely tame them without getting annihilated by, uh, well, you know, the Void Worms. We legit had one chase after us. Dude, their target range has to be insane, alright? Like, 
I was so far away, the next thing I know, it's like beelining it straight for me. Also, we have plants starting to poke up. Pixie, foliage just starting to come back on the shell. Crush, you're starting to get crusty. Okay, so I've gotten all three of my Astrodelphus. So what I'm going to do here is we're going to go over to the shield radius. And we're going to max this thing out all the way to 10. That is just so that way I have... I don't need the whole range, actually, I don't think. These guys aren't as big as the space whales. And even then, I didn't even need the barrier for the space whales. But, all right, let's get this going. Okay, so in terms of points, as you guys may have seen, we've already got 50 in health. But we also now have 40, of course, in stamina here from the female. And then we also have 50 in a melee that I got from another male now that male also has a 42 in his health which is in my terms acceptable but i'm also going to just be pairing with the 50 health with it that's just so we can have like the ultimate astro delphus all right now luckily with the other two um i hit them with the sanguine elixir immediately and then hit them with the what is it the pets and element now, I would not recommend Sanguine on these guys at all. It was a waste. Uh, but it seemed to have done something where it caused them to get 225s. Now, I think it's just like, again, I think there's just a bug with Sanguine. Alright? I've had occasions where I've popped it, like, right at the end. And this only works sometimes only at the end. I've never had it work beforehand like this, where, like, I gave up before them. Maybe I have, and I just haven't noticed. But, yeah, Sanguine can sometimes bug out and get you guys one extra level. I mean, that's not much, but, I mean, one extra level. Okay, so I've legit just looked up from my phone, finally waiting for these guys to breathe. And this is the first time I've been able to get this on camera. But we are in hyperspace. So, that means all the asteroids outside in the rings are gone right now. So, yeah, that means the asteroids out there are actually changing. Because apparently those rotate resources that are available so yeah but hyperspace i feel like it's the only time or nighttime well which is hyperspace is which i think the first two hours like it goes from midnight to two o'clock in the morning you're in hyperspace jumping to the next planet so yeah but i think it's just awesome because we can go and see the entire spacecraft or a good chunk of it through like the barrier like just at night while we're in this and i think it's awesome i'm not joking right as i jump back down into the portal it ended i miss getting that on camera that's a planet oh i've not noticed the planets yet that's like a volcano hold up let's see if we can get a closer look douche <laughs> douche douche <laughs> enhance oh i think this is a gas giant a gaseous planet i mean it could be it could also just be a volcanic hellscape from what my first thoughts were. I mean, what were the Genesis simula- Oh my god, why is my base all the way over there? Because I'm holding W like an idiot. Oh my god. Okay, here comes the first baby Astrodelphus. Woo! There we go. Now, hopefully, this guy has all the stats I need on it from Mommy and Daddy. In which- Yes, you do. You do. Yeah? Yeah, I have to look better. Okay, he is a keeper, and I have already disposed of the extra Astrodelphus. He went to the great space farm, you know, sent him there. Um, would not recommend doing it with the tech rifle, kind of felt expensive there. But yeah, that's why we got to get a shotgun. Shotgun's really effective at getting rid of, uh, extra dinosaurs now this guy's also growing up pretty quick so yeah he's getting big hopefully these guys get freed in here soon and i can just get you guys done and yeah um but in the meantime i think i'm gonna run over to extinction real quick and go get me some astrodelphus saddles so that way i can have saddles for the two that i have in the cryopods just so that way if i need to ride the breeding pair i can move them around and one for my own personal one to go test drive. 
Okay, so I have just gotten both of these guys finished. They're fully grown now. So now I should hopefully be able to just breed up them one more time. Uh, I'd say their colors are fairly similar. I didn't actually look while I had the cryopod. But I did check to make sure neither one of them have a mutation. So we not messed up. Um, yeah. Here are their stats side by side. So that way we can see what we need to merge. Now it does appear... I would 100% love the zero movement speed. I want the zero movement speed. Um, but yeah. Looks like we don't have much more work to do because the melee and... Not the melee. The food and the weight have both already leveled out. So yeah. Hopefully we get some more level out here. Okay guys. So as you may notice here, I got my Astro Delphys done. And I just got my first one from them bred up. So this one's going to be my personal space dolphin to write if I can fly up and get it. Oh, jeez. Come on, let me... Thank you. Oh. Back out the water. So we'll just pull him over here. We're going to do this little woot. And passive. And now what I'm going to do, we're going to cryopod up the parents. Because these guys are our breeding pair. And yeah, I'll show you the colors and stats that we got on them here. Um, here's the stats. So we got the 42 in stamina like we wanted, and we got the 51 in melee and 50 in health. Now, I don't know if these guys actually like are going to be any good with melee, because they're kind of like a fighter jet. Like, like, these saddles I've not powered up yet. I've rode them, but it appears that I need grenades to fire as well. Um, I do not have basic grenades to do that, so we will not be able to fire the grenades. But once this guy's fully grown, I'll get the, my one other saddle. It's still in here, isn't it? Yeah. It's still in the arc data. Yep. Yeah. So I'll get that one over and on this one, and then we'll go fly it around in test driver. Okay, so she has finished growing up. So we're going to take her out here. So, left control is to start up fighter ship mode. Let's hit it. Boom. So, then we just... Oh, and that's awesome. Oh, then we also have a normal attack, it appears. Oh. So, what are the grenades for? But anyways, it seems like this guy moves a lot faster than Dez. So, hold up. Let's do this. Let's go out into the space. Okay, so the way we're going out is through one of these ports here on the side instead of the main bridge. Wow. This guy actually moves quite fast with the jets. I ain't gonna lie. He's definitely gonna be my new get around the map because he's just so fast. Oh, where is he? Where's a void worm? I want to take on a void worm. Alright, like, that's what I want to do. Here's Space Whale. Oh, do I have a dive bomb? Oh, I think I do. Alrighty, so I guess I can dive bomb in this guy as well. So this is the... Br that, that was the bridge that we tamed you over at. So... Do I want to head into the Rockwell Zone and go just like fly around in there and look around? Because we didn't explore much in there. Or should I go fight a Void Worm? You know what? I think Rockwell Zone will save for next time. We need to find a Void Worm to fight. Like, I just want to fight one. If we got time, like, and we like do this real quick, like, I'm just trying to find one. Like, I don't see any. And this is a big like gap in space. I just let's hope that there's one down by this bridge because this is the side of the map I really haven't been towards. This is the bottom part, right? Yeah. Or am I heading towards the top of the map? No, because that's the Rockwell side there, so I am heading towards the bottom. So. Um, I don't see any void worms. I guess. Ugh, lag. Space is a little bit laggy for me as well. I will not lie. Just hoping for a void worm out here. Um. 
You know what? I guess we do know. There should have been one by the other one. Target spotted. Ah, oh, we've been hit. You can't fight me! I'm faster than you now! This is probably like a 1, like 60 or something. Let's get, can I actually like see your level? Ah! I forgot, there's actual cockpit. Ooh, maybe we can't take this guy out. I don't want to ruin my first dolphin to a... You know what, yeah, let's just go to the rock zone. Why not? We'll lose him here. I'm pretty sure we move way, way faster. Ah, no, you know what? I've already said we were going to commit to it. Problem is, is this is probably one of the good guy ones. Like, this is watching the 190. And I'm fighting it with the Astro Delphas right now. Pew 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 We killed him. He was a 150. Or what he was a level 50, not a 150. Sorry. Exclamation point there threw me off. But I think we'll just go up here through this tube and into the Rockwell zone. And here we are. Don't really know what we came over here for. I guess just to like look around. This is supposed to be kind of like a aberranty area, I guess. Not aberranty, Rockwelly. Uh -huh. There's like, you know what? If I were to ever actually like come here and set up an official base, I might do it in the Rockwell zone. I don't know if I'd do it over here where this is like completely flat. Oh, no. I would make a castle in the middle of this, alright? And then you have your moat around the castle, alright? Oh, yeah. I would so do it. I would make me a castle on top of that and make a moat around it. That is so what I would do. Um, so, we also got some weird things here. Like, remember Rockwell's tentacles from uh, Aberration? Well, we got them now, but instead of, like, having the weird prongy things that shoot lightning it's the I'm, I'm like slamming into a wall it's got like the tech effect if you guys recall um like in the tech cave there were like weird things where like the tech would just like had like holes in it like like there it was the glowing behind it and then it looked like that basically and it was like the tech style of growing like yeah you can see it over there there's another another tentacle another I can't believe I just said that. Twice. Uh. But it'd be nice to see if, like, say we could find a shadow main or something down here by the river. I think this is where we need to be. It's right, it's down by the river. To spot a shadow main. We'll fly low. But this is actually a really nice here. We'll go like that. First person. Oh, this is actually kind of awesome. I like this. Makes me feel like I'm actually, like, flying around in a tech fighter jet. I realize this guy is legit a tech fighter jet, but he's also an Astro uh, I'm I'm so glad that they had to make this a tameable, and then you had to make the saddle and not just go in for, like, oh, here's a tech jet. Um, one of the things as well that I might try and get is, is this a cave? We shouldn't go in here, but I want to. One of the things I want to get is one of the tech sails or whatever. Where, uh, oh, luckily it's just a pass. Where you, uh, stand on it and it's like a surfboard, but it has a sail. I want to get one of those, try, test it out. I might go build one of those on Extinction and bring it back over with me. I am definitely going to have to go back over and get some other stuff. 
Like I'm gonna have to trans make more transferable element and bring it with me. I think this is the cave that goes into his innards. I don't want to head in there though, because that'd be scary. Um. Yeah. Anyways, I don't think we're gonna see much here. Last thing I. Ooh, you know what I just realized as well. Flying low. We got noglins in this area. And Noglins are the guys that uh, mind control. Now, I'm not sure if I have them like as a breedable creature. I think there might be like one of the one-shot ones. But, yeah. I am also currently working on my collection. The mod pack collection. So, yeah. Hopefully, we get that done and all that. But, yeah. Anyways, you guys know the drill for now. Um, if you guys have liked what you guys have saw today, please do leave a like and subscribe. I try to respond to every comment, but most importantly, if you guys go and join up for the YouTube memberships, I should be able to respond to your comments more rapidly. I should see them sooner, basically. And also, the more YouTube members that we get, the higher the chance that I am able to start a server. So right now I am really thinking about it, and... I I'm hoping, but as as of like looking at it right now, I'm gonna be like, oh, I'm gonna be opening up a 20 person server. So I don't wanna like all of a sudden have a 20 person server with all you guys able to join and you guys flood the server, you know? So if that happens, I will have to absolutely lock it behind memberships. But if I get enough memberships today where I can host a 100 player server or 80 player server, we should be Gucci. But anyways, this has been Gun Chamare. Right.